Hey guys, your buddy Pete here. Got a quick little form that I, I put together. It's really pretty easy to do. You guys can do this yourself. But if you don't have software and you're trying to capture data, this is a really good uh, document. If you're interested, let me know and I'll send you a link. Uh, this is just to the people in the private group. But essentially, this is a prospect call log. Okay, so now let's look at the computer real quick, see if you can see what we're doing here. Now, I fill this out. You can, all this is editable, but this is a pros, prospect and call form. Uh, you start off by filling in for information. Who's the call taker? Who answered the call today? Well, it was Pete. Now, nah, let's put somebody else because I already did that. And let's say uh, Marie. Marie answered the phone today and um, she spoke with Mr. Ramsey. You just fill all this in, um, and I, I, it's just auto, automatically populated. And uh, so all the address, and here's the phone number. There's your cell phone number. Here's your home phone number. Here's your work phone number. Here's your email address, Ramsey Media LLC. That's my parent company, for those of you who don't know. And so that's it. So why did you call today? Well, I need a, a, I, I need uh, residential equipment in my house, commercial equipment. Um, I had a major repair. Maybe I need an estimate for that or something like that. Duct cleaning. Go ahead and put me a duct cleaning in there as well as this cool accessory, right? Uh, any special instructions? Uh, yeah, I have uh, a split level home, maybe. Okay. And then, so how'd you hear about us? Now, this is the key part right here. Listen to me. Look me in the eye. This is your key part. You want to capture your source and then see how good your closing ratio is based on the source. Now, here we go. So how'd you hear about us? Well, a service tech told me. No, it wasn't a service tech. Actually, I saw you on Facebook. Somebody was talking about you, too. And I checked out your website. I thought you were good. So these were the three, three things that might be there. So let's set that appointment up. We'll make it for the 18th. And let's make it for a.m. Let's go with uh, 9 in the morning, right? There we go. Who's the comfort consultant? Well, that's Mr. Pete Ramsey. He's a good guy. Okay. Maybe he rescheduled and we had to bump it back to a different day. Maybe not. So we'll skip that one. Uh, what's the investment amount? So $9,000 what was invested. It was sold. And there's some special comments here. He will be financing. Yep. That cool. Now, check this out. We just submitted it. So uh, what we do is we go into uh, the main document. You see responses here. And I've done three of these, just testing it out. And um, it's got a summary, and there's all these graphs and stuff that you can adapt, of course. But the main thing is, you see this over here? When you create this, it compiles all of the data for you. So when we're comparing all this data, I just put the same information uh, each time. But the point is, as we come through here, here's everything. It's captured. Uh, it's a $9,000 job. Um, it's uh, well financing. There's the appointment time. Uh, and, of course, we can move all this around. If we want to put, the, uh, put some of this stuff in some other locations, you can certainly do that. But the point is, you're able to track all of your information. It all goes into a single spreadsheet, and you can manipulate that data as you see fit. And ultimately, you can build a database for email addresses. You see here the email addresses right here. Let's open that up a little bit. There's the email addresses. I use HVAC Greatness at Gmail. I use Ramsey Media LLC at Gmail. You can use uh, you know whatever, and you can compile. I might later come in here and then copy these, and then I'll jump on here. And then I'll, I'll create a, 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 you can do this as well. Uh, check this out. Now, when you, if you're going to do this, don't send it to where everybody can read your email. Use your blind copy. You guys know this, hopefully. So in the blind copy, if it's BCC, when the person receives, uh, hello, uh, great service. And then we send that. Here, here it came through. It says hello, and when we look at the details, it it doesn't have all the two information. It was blind copied in. That means we can send it to a bunch of people at one time, but not not sharing everybody's email. Everybody's got got their privacy that way. So there's a lot of different things you can do with this. But the point is, it's just a nice document. When people call in, you capture all the information. It's stored in a database, and it's always there for your future reference. Let me know if this interests you. I'll share this with anybody who is interested. But you got to let me know. All right, you guys have a good uh, week. Talk to you on the next one. Pete Rams here. I'm out.